guys, it's Hattie and today I will be sharing my riding story. Let's go. My riding story started when I was three years old as I started to go to a riding school. I went to the riding school every Monday. It was great. I learnt so much. I went there for about a year and I still wanted to carry on. When I first started the riding school I learnt how to properly ride on a Shetland called Jumbo. I then started to grow out of him and I moved on to a black Shetland called Betty and I had great fun on her. I rode Betty for a year or so but it was time to move on. I then met a pony called Ripple. She was a Welsh pony and was 12 hands. It then came to one of the best days of my life. My fifth birthday was coming up. I was so excited. I got one of the biggest surprises of my life. My family surprised me with the Welsh section A black 12 hand pony. I named him Digger and from that day I had the most amazing experiences ever. I had Digger for about two years and in those two years we did a lot. I did all sorts of things on Digger but I did love dressage and hacking out. We went and succeeded in a lot of dressage shows and won lots of medals and rosettes. Digger was a really good pony. We even took him on holiday to Devon where we had a lot of fun going on the beaches and everything. He taught me so much and I enjoyed myself a lot. But sometimes it wasn't fun. Even though Digger was so good, we did have our bad times. Some of the times that we rode, he would buck and I would fall off. This went on constantly, quite a lot. I then lost my confidence and trust in him as I was falling off him. It was heartbreaking every time I fell off. In that point, I was still going to the riding school for lessons to get my confidence back into riding again. At that point, Me and my mum decided that we didn't have time to ride Digger, as it was awkward to ride him because he was kept in a place not near us and no arena to work in. Thank you all so much for watching this video, but it doesn't end here. There will be a part two uploaded next Sunday. Bye everyone!